What's up everybody, it's Robin Gaming here, and um, today I'm playing two matches actually. I'm going to be playing Classic Mode and I'm going to be playing on Blockmash Map 4. Um, this is basically... Okay, there we go. Um, so yeah, this is live. This is, this is a new uh, episode of Live Come Wednesday. And um, yeah, as I said, I'm, I'm playing live right now, the Classic Mode. And why is that? Because patch 1.15 for Uncharted 3 has just been released. And... Come on, Flynn, come on. Well, at least he's dead. Did I still drop a grenade? No, I didn't. Um, but yeah, it, it's classic mode, as I said, and I'm going to be playing block mesh map uh, 4. Patch 1.15 just got released. I'm pretty, you know, I'm pretty happy with some things that Naughty Dog did. There's some things I still have my doubts about. Um, but yeah, classic mode, it's basically Uncharted 2 mode. Crap, I need to... It's it sucks that you can't throw back grenades because of the lag. Um, just die. <laughs> there we go. So um, wow, I'm I'm coming across enemies all the time. It's insane. Is there actually less health? I'm wondering about that. Yeah, come on, come on. Why didn't he get hit by that? Oh, look at that, nice. <laughs> So uh, yeah, there's there's there is actually boosters. Um, there's no metal kickbacks. There's a Flynn that just dropped a grenade. Um, uh, let's see. There's no throwbacks for grenades. Uh, it's basically you know really like in Charter 2 where you start off with an AK with a Power 9. There's no loadouts by the way, so you can't choose your own weapon. It's all AKs and Power 9s. Ah, he just killed his teammate. Oh, uh, we can still do high fives though. That's not really what to do like. Come on, dude. Come on. <laughs> yeah, I'm playing with two friends of mine who never take this game serious, so that's when you get. Okay. Um. Yeah. What else did Naughty Dog do? They added a extra section to the main menu where you can purchase uh, more Uncharted games, but also watch trailers or and and stuff like that. Um. Yeah. I didn't feel like that was really necessary. Come on. Oh, I have no grenades. Oh, is it so that you don't have any grenades when you spawn? Or did I use my grenade? I'm not sure. Just die, Flynn. Okay, nice. <laughs> yeah, because I'm playing on Desert Village, it's pretty hectic, you know? I, I'm, you know, I find a lot of enemies and it's gunfights all the time. Whoa, I'm not doing too bad. Okay, nice. Um, yeah, Naughty Dog tweaked the tournament system as well. And, you know, I'm, I'm like, yeah, well, what's the point of tweaking the tournament system? Uh, to be honest, I don't like the tournament system at all. I really think it's, it's uh, yeah, I have no idea why they feel felt like they had to add that in patch 1.13. Um, yeah, it's like, you know, I, I'm not going to do it for the rewards. I really don't care because you only keep them for like one week. There's really no use to it for me. Um, get killed by that grenade, please. Ah, that's a shame. Oh, look at that. Still got the assist. Um, but yeah, what they did do is they did like really fix the treasure drop rate. And um, yeah, with that, I mean, if you, if you spend a tournament ticket, that means that you'll have an increased treasure uh, rate drop treasure drop rate I mean <laughs> um, so yeah you will have to uh, use a tournament taken for the you know for for a match and then you will have an increased what was it increased drop rate that's right <laughs> so um, yeah that's that's what they did but also uh, with extensively playing so that means if you just play for like an hour or something I don't know the exact time frame right I assume that it's like an hour um, or maybe even half an hour or something like that. But when you do that, that means you'll automatically get a treasure drop upon upon the next kill. And okay, I'm not gonna be able to kill him. Nice. Oh, there's still someone there. Not anymore. <laughs> yeah. Um. They also tweaked revenge, by the way. And I was like, yeah, great. But yeah, I'm I'm not really too happy with it because what they did and. God. 
Oh, look at that. That's a revenge. Idiot. Um, because what they did, you can't kill your own teammates now with revenge grenade grenades. And that might seem like a good thing. But if you think about it, it only means more people are going to use revenge probably. Because they're like, oh, I'm not going to kill my teammate with it anyway. So, you know, I can just use it without people complaining. Um, yeah, I just feel like Nautilus should really remove revenge from the game altogether. Um, it's absolutely, absolutely no use to it. So, um, yeah, I mean, all that, all that kind of stuff that really helps, you know, new players, that should just get out of the multiplayer. Um, you know, I, I'm really not a supporter of revenge or boosters like that. So, yeah, next time, please just remove it, Naughty Dog, so you don't have to patch it all the time. I'm going fairly, fairly well. 18 kills, 4 deaths. Um, there we go. You know what it is? I think it's just, you know, the AK is my normal weapon. It's the weapon I use all the time, so I got pretty uh, experienced with that weapon, and I think that's really a big advantage. Um, they also seem to fix the matchmaking, which means that people from like the same legacy levels now get put together or something like that, or at least when making the teams, uh, you know, if you add up all the legacy levels, it should be at like the same number all the time. Um, so yeah, that that's pretty good I guess so you don't have to play against uh, you know against uh, you know unfair teams all the time so you don't have unfair teams all the time anyways this was classic mode I'm now gonna skip right ahead to block match map 4 so on to the next match which is on block match map 4 I haven't played on this yet so this is really my first impression um, what is this is this some kind of fountain or anything I have no idea it, it does kind of look pretty similar to uh, block match map 1, but I could be wrong there, um, yeah, I'll see about that, oh, it still has those bridges, yeah, it does, it is really similar to block match map 1, <laughs> anyways, um, yeah, in this match I want to talk about uh, the cinema mode, because what Naughty Dog did is they patched the cinema mode, um, you can now add block match map games to your uh, cinema mode, and you can now send those, that's great, um, I wish I didn't get stealth killed from behind there, because I had the hammer. Um, but yeah, you can now send me your block match map clips for the top 10 plays, for Connected. Um, talking about Connected, there were still a few people that said, hey, I wasn't able to send you my clip for Connected, can I still send them? Um, and you know what, I'm just going to say, yes, you can. Uh, for the whole week, this week, maybe even next week, I don't, I don't mind. I, I mean, Connected will be uploaded in three weeks. I'm just going to edit it on the fly. Um, and you can still just send me your clips, and I will just keep watching them. Um, I hate this guy who stole my hammer though, but, um, sorry for that, had to replace my mic. Um, yeah, you can still send me your clips for Connected. I watched a big amount of clips. I wasn't able to watch everything, so, um, yeah, it's not like assured that I've watched a clip. Uh, but again, I got so many clips. I got like 200 clips for that whole montage, and it's only five minutes of, you know, of, you know, the, the montage itself. It's, o it's only five minutes or something like that. So, yeah, that really, um, you know, that really means I'm not going to be able to put everything in. I already know that. So, yeah, just make sure you send me an awesome clip. As I said, you can now also just send me clips on the block mesh maps. Uh, I guess that would also be pretty cool for, uh, for Connected. So just do that. Send them to the PSN of RG Montages. Why am I not... Be oh, look at that. I'm not doing really well this match, though. Throw it back. Nice. That was a face slam to the ground. And I get marked, of course. So, um, yeah, they took this bridge element again from Italy. So I'm pretty sure now that Italy is going to be an Uncharted 4. <laughs> no, but, uh, yeah, as I said, I really think they're like, testing different structures of the maps, different layouts, just seeing what works, what doesn't work, so they can make Uncharted 4 a perfect multiplayer. I mean, that's what it really needs. I mean... When they announced in Charter 3, they said, okay, we're going to put a lot of effort in it now so it can compete, you know, the multiplayer can compete with all the big multiplayers. And let's face it, Uncharted 3 didn't compete with Battlefield or Call of Duty. There's still a lot of people playing it, but a lot of people is like 50,000, which compared to Battlefield and Call of Duty is nothing. Um, but of course, it's about the quality if, you, if you're if you talking about really competing. Um, and let's face it, I mean, it is a great multiplayer, it's so much fun, I think it is so much fun. And that's why I'm playing it 
more than Battlefield or Call of Duty at the moment. Um, yeah, this is on number one, Battlefield on number two, and Call of Duty I rarely ever play now because I got just, I really got bored of that multiplayer. I'm wondering if Black Ops 2 will bring any change into that. Is that another swing, swinging pull? I'm not sure. But yeah, just, there are still things that just don't make sense in a multiplayer games, game, like uh, the, the lagging and stuff. Just, you know, you walking over a grenade um, and you're, you know, the distance between you and a grenade is very big, but it still kills you for some reason. Um, die. Nice. S you know, stuff like that. The the matchmaking that still takes hours sometimes to find a match. Um, they really needed to fix that in Uncharted 3, and they didn't do that. Um, that's a shame. I really hope that for Uncharted 4 they invest in, in battle servers, all that kind of stuff. And they really, really make it a good multiplayer so they can have a new fresh start. And I hope a lot of people will play it. Of course, because it's the beginning of a new console generation, maybe, you know, games like Call of Duty or Battlefield aren't even out by then. Um, so that means people are going to play Uncharted for the multiplayer and they're really going to try it. Um, so that's really a big opportunity for Uncharted now to catch up with the multiplayer and to make sure people are staying and playing it. So, you know, they don't go to, you know, the normal uh, Battlefield, Call of Duty, FIFA, whatever they play. And they just stick with Uncharted. I really hope that's going to happen with the uh, with Uncharted 4. Um, but yeah, these block match maps were, you know, they they aren't made right now. It's not that people are working on it right now. That's you know a general uh, excuse. People, you know, people have people really think. Some people think that you know Uncharted 4 isn't in the making because Naughty Dog is making The Last of Us. Now, I've said this before, but this of course bullshit just to put it that way because Naughty Dog split into two teams that's what they've been saying that's what they confirmed uh, there has al they have already been working on The Last of Us uh, after Uncharted 2 was finished and then they pretty much split up one team went working on The Last of Us one team on Uncharted 3 the Uncharted team at that point was of course a lot bigger still um, but right now I believe the teams are about the same size um, but also some people are saying they're not working on Uncharted 4 because just look at all the patches for Uncharted 3, the support. And okay, I'm going to be very honest here. If you th really think that's the case, that Naughty Dog is working for a year after the game released and they're still working on Uncharted 3 with all of their, um, you know, all of their men, all of their employees, that's just, that's not true because just... These patches, no offense, these patches are great. They're, it's awesome to see these block match maps, but it's it's n it really doesn't take them a lot of time to make it. Um, the few tweaks, it's really, I believe that's maybe a team of two or three player, uh, I mean two or three employees, or maybe five that just work on it for maybe I don't know, even less than a week probably. Uh, whoa, I got pulled down there. I didn't see that coming. Um, yeah, really, it. Look, I just, that's, okay, Th this is exactly what I mean with what they need to fix. I spawned right next to a grenade that, you know, um, hit me, and I fell to the ground and someone killed me, even with double damage. Double damage, of course, needs to be removed as well, because that's just, it makes no sense. Okay, come on, he didn't see me yet. There we go. Does he have a T-bolt? Ah, oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, double damage turns the Dragon Sniper into a T-Bolt. That's pretty stupid because it's semi-automatic and you don't have to reload with every shot, of course. Oh god, that's, that was stupid of me, I know. Never activate your kickbacks when in double damage and you know you're gonna die. Um, was there actually anything else Naughty Dog added? Um, yeah, 11 new taunts. I haven't been able to check them out yet. I'm going to do that right now after this match. Um, and is there anything else? Well, I was talking about, you know, that I really think that testing different things for Uncharted 4. Is double damage still active? No, it isn't. I can't see anything with these block match maps. <laughs> if I'm hit and the, the, the screen turn, turns white, that's really, you can't see anything. But yeah, as I said, Please, you can still send me in your clips for Connected. Uh, just keep doing that and I will still uh, watch them and edit it on the fly. Um, 
yeah i mean i did give the release date for uh for connected in the top 10 plays episode 18 and that is in three weeks um in three weeks i will upload connected um but yeah i'm, I'm really having doubts if i should have done that because it's it's gonna be a big project it's gonna take me a lot of time to make and i'll try to do it um but yeah hopefully you know i'll have enough good clips as i said i'm looking m mainly for dragon clips t-bolt clips power weapon clips uh grenades uh, you know if you if you kill someone or if you if you kill let's say three four enemies with one grenade um you know those moments are great for a montage and a normal regular ak 5 no life is not that's just i i did get submissions like that where people just had a 5 no life with their m9 did you see that animation that was really weird um but yeah th they aren't really fitting and i as i said i can't guarantee every clip to be in because i got so many for that montage but you can still send me in your clips on block mesh maps on uh, classic mode I, I really hope they also added classic mode by the way to uh, to cinema mode um, but i guess so and then uh, yeah i thank you a lot for watching and i hope to see you next time